G'day, this is Ozeko. Let's play some more EU4 Common Sense as France. Trying for the big blue blob achievement. I don't know how well it's going to go. I mean, looks alright. Got 42 provinces with however long to go. But if you go take a look at France, we are almost completely occupied. Got, what, one fort left? Two forts left, one's under siege. Yeah, not great. Austria needs to come in and help with that. Brunswick accepted peace from Magdeburg. Can we accept peace from Magdeburg? No, why the hell not? Hmm, stupid coalition. Why do you keep telling us about freaking Tunis? I couldn't care less. It's not even on the list. Alright. The Emperor of Austria has died. Bohemia is in. And of course, Bohemia dropped us as an ally. Lose to war exhaustion or gain tradition. I don't see any point in gaining tradition, so. What's our war exhaustion? Wow. Yeah, we'll lose some war exhaustion next. Yeah, suck that England. Portugal, you're the one who declared. Would have given Porto back to you, but no. Wasn't good enough. We had to release Scotland and give everything back to Castile and do all sorts of crap we weren't going to do. Mecklenburg and Magdeburg. Come on. You're not going to piece us out. Why are you piecing everyone else out? Lost Leoness. One Trondelag. Good. So get out of one more at least. We will take Trondelag. Oh, god damn it. Well, we don't need that one. Good. That is our demand. France. We're up to 47. How long is that going to last? Alright, V5. Go, 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 go. And Trondelag. Didn't even get our claims. Alright. Nothing else we can do, is there? No. Alright, cause. There's not much overextension just for that, but Bergen Schuss is the only one we can do, and then we can only get, I think, to Trondelag, and then we have to go to there, and then we have to go to there, and blah blah blah. So, let's get in Muscovy. Don't like us. We're allied to Poland. Well, we're going to stay allied to them, so too bad. We will fabricate on cola because that's what we do. So why can't we? No, because it's a different country, do Yep, so we could fabricate at Arkhangelsk, but we're not going to anytime soon. What we are going to do is wish that we'd been black flagged from there because we're not going to be able to get through and do anything useful. Hmm. 24 sounds kind of close enough. And of course, we get kicked out. Let's go out of there on the 6th. We're going to be sunk by them. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Uh, Lost the Invincible is the first to die, of course. It's a lot of cannons. Alright. We actually did lose one. That's bullshit. Alright. So, these mongrels. You just let us out. I'm not going to give you anything. And they probably have occupied our land. Which means they're blocking Portugal from occupying our land. Still losing money, yep. Should have just mothballed the forts. Since they're about to take our last one down in the board, it's on 7%, 14%. Alright, we have a spare diplomat. Let's just go fabricate on Castile because why wouldn't we? Not really worried about aggressive expansion. I need 
make stupid offers because we don't have a guy. Yep, there goes the board. So he's going to go sit on our last couple, which don't even have forts, and will be completely occupied, except for our new land in Norway. Group up. How far off are you? Quite a way. Let's just split them in half. Britney's entered an alliance with people they're already in a war with. Gilray is doing crap we don't care about. Bavaria we don't care about. Ugh. All our allies are in. And Aragon's out. Good one, Aragon. Chicken. Yeah, everyone's low. We've got no chance. Stupid freaking coalition. So we have 13 ships, would that mean possibly that we can sneak over there to the highlands? Where's his fleet? Oh, there's part of it, it's that, Flanders. <laughs> Hostile attitude. Why would you have a hostile attitude? It wasn't our fault. Yeah, lose another battle there. Slaughtered in another battle there. Brandenburg's out. Good. Numbers looking a little too far in our favour. Lorraine, how would you feel about piecing up? What would you require? You wouldn't even consider it. A claim on Madrid. Well, we obviously need a claim on Castilla. On Castilla. Fabricate on Castilla. Okay. Absolutely necessary. We need those. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Aggressive expansion is decent. It was barely over. Like, come on. The piece with Portugal was too short, was the issue. guys on the way over to uh, soon. Lose stability, lose legitimacy. Well, no. Who needs diplo points, huh? Alright, can we do a quick runner without England noticing us? They're already there. Let's go. Well, what's the chance? No, there's no way. Denmark. Well, they would. Bring it through Sweden, or does Denmark give it to us automatically? Norway would not. <laughs> okay. 
get it automatically from Sweden somewhere. Let's get this guy down here. So, 60 under 90. We out cavalry them. If we could pull this off, it'd be freaking amazing. We go Poland on our side. Not for long. Negative 7. Yeah, they're about to piece everyone there out. Before our army can get down there and actually take part in the war for a bit. Their fleet is it all England, Portugal, and everyone else? Well, let's see what we can do. We make a quick run for there. Gonna run into England on the way. We have a claim! Yay! We've claimed all of Castile that we can reach. And after that, our diplomats can just sit there doing nothing. Didn't find the fleet. Well, nowhere else to park down here. So let's take a crack to Portugal and then try and come back. Yep, England's over here now. I guess means we could get over to there if we were lucky. Alright, who are we at war with? So we don't have the Emperor on our side. We're in a defensive war, so if we can improve with him. Oh, come on. Don't like being allied to Poland. Too bad. Deal with it. Alright, in the meantime, we would have to get through. First problem is the Hansa. Second problem is Oldenburg. If we can kill them quickly, we'll be fine. Captured one. Didn't really want to. It's fine though. Alright, you can now somehow get all the way to Christmas. Good. And you will go stand in the woods of Gabray. Time, Bohemia. You would love to join this war. Damn it. Why is that not diplomatic relations? But, you know, we were at war before. Why is that suddenly an issue now? Alright, we're back in there. We're healed up. Where are his fleets? There's Portugal. 5113 under 365. Might as well go for it. I'm going to use the transport for anything else. Be cannon bait. Capture the transport. Good. Alright. 98. They're yeah, kind of low, but it's not going to make much of a difference. So we'll just head... Ah, oh, Portugal. So we'll just head straight up there. Friesland. Good. Alright, still got all our guys. We're about to start dying. These are not, so we just go to Trombolo. We killed one of his transports. Yay for us. Alright, Pope. 
need some help, buddy. Okay, I suppose you'd like to help out. Nope. Alright, so Denmark, we no longer need military access. The Hansa. No longer need it. Did we get it from anyone else? Mm, Oldenburg. Cancel. Alright. Now, Bohemia. That stupid at war penalty. We were at war before. That's why we called you. <sighs> Alright. Well, we don't need them anymore anyway. Ooh. Hey, Switzerland. I feel like joining the war. Let's see. Alright. I forgot about that. Oh, we just need to get the war score up. If we just retake France by ourselves. With Moldavia, that should help. Well, not for long. Off for tribute. Clear offer, suggest offer. Right, seed Porto, that's fine. Seed 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 to Castile, no. Release Scotland, no. Go to hell. Porto, release Guillen. Just Porto and Guillen. Well, Guillen takes like five things, I think. Do we actually have a chance? Not really. What could we do? We could possibly get a better offer. He's not going to be able to take Trondelag for a while. Could we siege back forts? Big deal claims and all that. No, they don't. I don't know. We've got 25. He's got just buttloads. He's about to take that. So, yeah, we'll just accept that. He's got no better things to do. Hello, Guillen. So we lose one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Do we keep the cores? No, of course not. Keep them when England takes them, but not when Guillen. Fine, you fucking asshole. More than a hundred total development. By how much? Twelve, twenty-four, twenty-five, forty-five, fifty-five. 66, 80, 97, plus 8, 105, so he's in slightly over. If he loses one of them, he would be willing to be vassalized. Hmm. Well, let's go on the assumption that that'll happen at some point in the next five years. And the aggressive expansion is still massive with them. Oh. Hey, Aragon. What is your freaking problem now? You won all our provinces. Well, screw you. You're not getting them. <sighs> Allies. Over here. Need to. Notice that we're black flagged. Need to have it here. And here. Alright, if we immediately declare on them. Nobody would join. They're all chickens. Alright, Muscovy, start declaring and start declaring, start fabricating on them. No, Brandenburg, we don't trust you one iota. Or you, Bohemia. Go to hell. Alright, so what do we get down to? 38. Not particularly good. Um, 
gonna... I don't know. Should we keep playing it on? I don't think we really got any chance. Once you get a coalition, it doesn't work. So, I'm gonna end this one here. I don't think there's any way we could get the big blue blob achievement on this one. We could go and take bits of Muscovy and get up to, I don't know, 70 odd. But wouldn't be able to get up to 100. No way in hell. 30 years, too many wars we'd have to do. Could get stuff off Castile. Got a nice long treaty with Portugal. Or is it 282? Yeah. Um, which of course is with England and everyone else as well. But yeah. 13 years, not enough. Yeah, can't do it. So, I'm going to give up here. And, I don't know, might try another one. Might not. Let's see. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And I'll see you again soon.